All right, guys, welcome to the April 1st, 2019 Squad Ops community meeting. Uh, we don't have a lot of news this month. Uh, we do have a little first things. Um, puppies that take leadership will get a priority for FTL if they request it. So if you have taken leadership practical and you want to FTL, let your squad leader know and you will be given priority over people without the leadership tag. All right. Um, right now, if you have any questions, anything squad ups related, go to the hashtag community meeting text channel and put any questions you have in there. Any questions for ops, anything ops related goes in community meeting text channel. It should be unlocked. You sure? Yeah. I don't have permissions for that. Yeah, job. it's not unlocked. Let me see. No, oh, staff can't. <laughs> All right, changed. All right. Muffin Man, more UK friendly times. Right now, there's no talks about adding or changing ops times, but I can write it down and I could suggest it. Normally, session one time is our Euro European friendly time. Helco is sought looking for people at this time. Iron, you here to answer that? Um, what the deuce? All right. Uh, if you're interested in sought, you can apply. I don't know when they will be checking those. Zabari, are we going to change the public server invasion only and put more layers? Hero won't be considered until V13. Dash B, any new mods with operations? No, right now we're just sticking to the squad ops mod. You guys have questions put it in the community meeting text channel for those who just joined Nuclear Twister. I saw the heli mod is no longer required. Is it a hold off until V13? Uh, no, right now we are. There were some issues with the mods and people crashing, so we, we're trying to test which mod's doing that: the squad ops mod or the heli mod. That's why it was taken off. Zabari, we're gonna get more EU timed events a lot of the EU joint squad ups and we only have one event in the weekend if I'm not wrong US have like three to four a week I know this community is most US lads but a lot from EU uh as of right now there's no plans to change any of the times uh but as I said before I will write it down and suggest it to management
For those of you that just joined, if you have any questions squad ops related, put them in the hashtag community meeting text channel. Elko for mod dev, are they bracing for impact when V13 drops? What can we expect to break and still work? I believe the mod will most likely break, so mission dev is preparing ops that don't require the mod. It's all going to break. Because the, there's an engine change in V13 to 4.21, so it's it's going to... However, it might be fixed fairly quickly, just because the major breakage will be the engine change. Group, why are there not more vehicles, tanks used in PS ops? Bag of Joe or Money Man, are you here to answer that? Yeah. So, the reason we don't usually use tanks and other heavy vehicles like Bradleys and stuff is because they're really hard to balance them. Uh, they're cool to have, but really the fun's only going to be had by that one. So, when we design the ops, uh, a lot of importance gets placed on what's fun for everybody, right? Yeah, but why not in postscriptum? That, which was the actual question. I don't follow. Xpit, this Sunday there's a tank in the mission for postscriptum. All right. There you go. Uh, Helco, what was the main reason for disabling the heli mod in ops? Uh, a lot of people were crashing, and we wanted to test if it was a heli mod or the actual squad ops mod that was causing it. Mod dev is still testing it. Kill Sue, I like to bring up the idea of bringing back Friday Night Firefights, have it be infantry focused, have the new people who completed SOT leadership training but not given the certification yet, BSLs and these ops to receive practice and have admins be SOT instructors to watch how they do. I can write that down and suggest it to Mission Dev and SOT. Let me copy that. Jack. Frontline radio going to make a comeback? Yes, I do believe Shadow and Content Creation are going to try to get that back up and running. Fox your acorn official spaceman point of view stream when <laughs> I don't know whenever he wants kill Sue I think the two cool ops for this will be the operation dust devil and second on the CQB range and the ops training base will be good all right I'll write that down server error is Friday fun coming back yes but you're not invited Helco, does content creation want more people? How would one apply? I'm not sure if content creation is looking for anyone right now, but if you can still apply, applicate, staff applications are in the README. For anyone that just joined, if you have questions regarding squad ops, put it in the community meeting text channel.
Groot, any reason to that I can't register for leadership practical? You need some tag I don't know about. Yeah, you need the leadership uh, theory tag. And to get that, I believe you need SOT advanced before that. Any SOT person verify that? That is correct. So yeah, get your advanced tag, then your leadership theory, and then you could take leadership practical. Extra, has anyone ever passed SL practice from the first attempt? Yes. Cloth boy, how often are pe are people going to become regulars or reviewed to become regulars? Uh, there's no set schedule, but if we do see your name often, uh, we can bring you up for voting whenever we want. Uh, if any of you do want to become regulars in the README, there's a regular expression of interest form, basically meant for you to get your name out there. So if we do see you in operations a lot, we can take note of that. But that is not an application to become a regular. It is not. Helco, of all the teams that are available, which teams are starved for more people? Uh, I'm not really sure. I think most of the teams are good right now, but that doesn't stop you, stop you from applying because there's always a need for more help. Uh, Frost, what's up with the aliases for some staff? I'm not really sure. For anyone that just joined, if you have any questions regarding squad ops, put it in the community meeting text channel. <laughs> we'll be wrapping up this meeting in around five, five, ten minutes. It looks like questions are starting to die down. Hey, myself and Darkfire from Rebound Gaming Network, a new, a new organizing body for squad events. We were wondering if Ops would be interested in participating in a mature multi-clan and outside of squad ops, but I need to be... Uh, you can DM me. It, the R, RGN guy, you can DM meeting droid. Dark Droid. <laughs> we recently changed the basic certified tech to green, and I've noticed there's a ton of people in the Discord that are not basic certified. Is there any plan to reach out to those people and see if they're interested in doing ba in doing basic and getting ops? Uh, I can bring that up. The issue is, like, I know a lot of people join uh, the the Discord just because they like playing on our public servers and you know Karma Cut. So I don't know if a lot of people are in here are necessarily uh, planning on doing ops. Box Eric Corn, any plans for the use of T civilian slash surrender kits should the devs decide to implement? Um, I'm not really sure if that's possible. Tony here. You. Uh, yeah. Which what switch kits? So like making like a surrender kit or a civilian kit. 
Well, it Let's looks see. like the devs added a surrender animation in V13 based on some of the stuff they were showing off. So uh, if there is a surrender animation, we will use it. If not, there are definitely plans to, um, yeah, get some, get some, maybe hostage kits, maybe civilian kits. We'll, we'll figure it out. All right, Muffin, how do I get ops ideas to you guys? As of right now, the ops ideas is closed. I know the mission dev team is going to be making a form for mission ideas, and that's going to be announced soon. I don't have a date. Just wait for that form to get out. Extra squad ops, GG, RAS, only 24-7. Anytime soon? Maybe. Uh, did I skip a question? Elko, any outreach plan for media personalities? Uh, yeah, we have talked about reaching out to people. Right now, you know, we have Karma Cut and Diplex sometimes plays. Bloth Boy, for such a small class, how often will you guys hold a leadership practical saw? What, what will have to happen for it to be conducted more often? Anyone from SOT can answer that? Near? I can answer it. I'm just thinking of uh, an answer for it. Um, right now, I know we're dealing with um, uh, different ways to make it so that we can have more SOP members uh, get burnt out a little bit less on BASIC. And so hopefully that will help with practical. Whether or not that'll make um, more practical classes or not, we'll, we'll have to see. But right now, we're trying to make practical the best course that it can be. And then we'll worry about um, how many courses we all right, Dixfolk, who creates new ops and which staff team should I talk to about new ops? As I said, uh, new ops suggestions are closed right now. Uh, the mission dev team will be making a form for anyone to use. It'll be announced soon. I don't have an exact date. Um, Vladimir Putin, uh, next leadership theory. Iron, do you know when the next leadership theory is? If it's not on the calendar, then it hasn't been announced yet. Okay. That's it. Crazy. Any idea what happened with the CQC in the calendar? Did we sort the issue? Back to iron. <laughs> um, I'm not privy to that information, unfortunately. So I don't know. Okay. Helco. The squad ups mod dev accept maps from outside the team. What are the things to keep out in the former is yes. Is the former is yes. Uh, I think you can send all any things you've made to Pony. Sebi, does event plan on replacing events on Saturday with PS events and any plans on squad firefights? Um, as of right now, no. And squad firefights, not really sure. Extra, what to expect on ESL practice training and how to prepare. Um, I took leadership practical and basically you, you're going to be leading people. So if you want, I, I would suggest maybe, um, signing up to FTL and ops or, you know, play pub squad and SL. Just try to get the leadership whole de thing down. Prepare your comms, etc. That uh, people couldn't sign up for CQC event in the calendar. I think the problem was. Anyone saw it knows the, the issue with the CQC event? Okay, uh, I don't, I don't have an answer for you, crazy. Uh, Sloth Boy, when will the Helimod come back? I don't know. When I prove empirically to Dorf that it's not causing these issues with squad. All right, blame Dorf. Uh, Wash Baby, time zone for calendar. It's your time zone. All right. We're going to end this meeting in around five minutes. Any last minute questions, put it in community meeting, text channel. Squad ops related questions, please.
Dorf, when are we going to do another giveaway? Uh, I don't know. I could bring it up. Copy it right now. I'll bring it up in the meeting tonight. MP5, thoughts on calling GG when objectives are completed for either team as opposed to waiting till everyone on either side gets eliminated. Yeah, so the the reason why we call GG when everyone's eliminated because sometimes the objectives would be completed before everyone gets in action. So we had situations where people didn't do anything for 30 minutes. They were off objective and the objective got completed and they just sat there. So it kind of gets boring. So we want to make sure everyone has action. Zabari, are we going to get Squad Up's products like t-shirts of Operations Logo or something? Maybe. I know something might be... I think they might be working on it, but I could suggest it. Yeah, Zabari. Jack, any more thought been given to the Ops Awards as brought up in the last community meeting? Nope, but I'll write it down. All right, we're going to end this meeting in like two minutes. Any last-minute questions, please put it in community meeting chat. Liberal, where is my heli training tag? Throwing that to you, Iron. Um, a lot of those tags, especially with the heli mod, um, would be Phoenix is the person you should talk to. I believe he's one of the people who is the only instructors. I think him and Karma I might be wrong with that though. Helco for web dev is the advanced cert tag issue fix as of late. Back to you, Iron. Do you know if, if that tag was fixed? Which tag? Repeat last. Uh, advanced cert. Um, last time I checked, it wasn't working, but they could have gotten it working in the last day or two. Um, I'd have to find out myself. Um. Can we do Star Wars events? No. Uh, Wash baby. Name of the mods needed for stop basic. You need the squad ops mod. That should be linked in every event announcement. So you should check there. Sloth boy, how would you go to about to train to stream the ops? Right now, the streaming is only reserved for regulars and up, but you can record. Your POV, just no streaming. Link to mod pack broken. All right, let me get you the mod real quick. Actually, can someone can someone get that for me? It's in the README. They they don't. I think the mod pack is it broken though. Oh, the mod pack link. It's possible, but like just all all the mods you need are in the README, kids. You can find them there. Well, but but there there will there there is one more but we'll be we'll be getting to that at the very end of the meeting so all right any last minute questions before i lock this channel got a minute they're working on whitelist Any plans on a reg versus pub match? Um, nothing set in stone, but the idea has been thrown around. All right, if you got a question, you got a couple seconds, put it in real quick.
All right, give me one second. I got something to announce. All right, one more thing for the last part of this meeting. All right, the Squad Ops mod dev team is happy to announce our new partnership with a new era mod team. Together, we will be bringing you an entirely new one life experience set in the Star Wars universe, which will be replacing all our events over the coming months. To get a taste of what's coming, download the a new era mod from the Steam Workshop. Check out the VR, not Tatooine Urban Layer, added to the Squad Ops mod earlier today. There will be a special test event later this evening, open to anyone with basic cert. Stay tuned for details. So right now, I'm going to post the link to the mod. I suggest you download it now and keep your eye on the event announcements channel. But yep, that wraps up the meeting. Thank you guys for coming out.